Lin Chen is reborn in the world of covering the sky, awakening the fishing systems of the heavens. No need for bait, no knowledge of air force, can fish for treasures from all over the world. Fishing successful, located at the Ji family in the southern region, obtaining the supreme bone. Fishing successful, located at the demon emperor's tomb, obtain the original true solution. Fishing successful, located in an ancient forbidden area, obtaining the true dragon treasure technique. Fishing successful, located at the end of a mortal road, obtain the technique of transforming oneself into others. Countless years later, Lord Lin Chen ascended to the heavens and pointed his sword at the end of darkness. The road can be quiet, and the sacrificial path can be destroyed. This sword cuts off your eerie vein. Keywords of the novel Covering the sky Fishing for the supreme bone, greedy crying my concubine purple moon. No pop-ups, covering the sky. Fishing for the supreme bone, crying for the beautiful purple moon. Download the complete set of TXT, covering the sky. Fishing for the supreme bone, crying for the beautiful purple moon. Latest chapter reading. Chapter 1. Fishing System. Fusion Supreme Bone. You are listening at Novel Full Audio. Chapter 1 Fishing System. Fusion Supreme Bone. Beidou. The Eastern Wilderness and Southern Regions. There is an ancient river that has been flowing continuously for 100,000 years, named Ji River. Across the river, clouds and mist churn, and the gate of the heavenly palace hangs in the air. Various temples soar above the clouds, and spirit birds dance like fairyland. This is the Ji family. Overlooking the eastern wilderness, there are few inheritances that can be compared, and there has been an ancient emperor. A young man sat in the courtyard of the Ji family. Handsome and elegant, with a towering head and horns, possessing the qualities of a great emperor. With my excellent height of 1.85 meters and flawless appearance, I should have spent a good night with countless beautiful and lovely girls on Blue Star. Unexpectedly, he was reborn into the burial emperor star in the heavenly world, still a mortal body that is not good at cultivation. The future is promising. Lin Chen sighed inwardly. He is not a native of this world, but a reborn from the Blue Star. Reborn for eighteen years, but still stagnant in the realm of suffering. This qualification cannot be said to be unparalleled, it can only be said to be unattractive. If it weren't for him being the son of an old friend of the Holy Master of the Ji family, he would have been expelled from the Ji family long ago. Oh my goodness, I don't have high expectations. Just give me a chaos body, an innate holy body, or something like that. What kind of ghost is it that I haven't broken through the realm of the spring of life for eighteen years? Is this the rhythm of wanting me to be a playboy, eating and waiting for death? Having the protection of the holy master of the Ji family is enough to ensure that Lin Chen has no worries about food and clothing in his lifetime. As a reborn person, who is willing to be ordinary? The weak can only go with the flow, only the strong can control their own destiny. At this moment, a voice rang out in Lin Chen's mind. Ding! The system is fully charged and the presence of the host has been detected. The Zhu Tian fishing system has been bound hush. This familiar tinkling sound as a ten-year-old bookworm, Lin Chen immediately realized what had happened. The system may be late, but it will never be absent. After charging for eighteen years, the system really has you. But it's better to have it than not. The system, please tell me what you can do. Lin Chen asked. This system can fish for treasures from various heavens and worlds, and the host can fish at any time and place the first fishing reward is the best in different locations, with unlimited fishing times, no need for bait, and no air force skills after listening to the explanation, Lin Chen's eyes lit up. Fishing for treasures from all over the world, unlimited in frequency, and even without the need for bait. This system is too awesome. Compared to those garbage systems that force hosts to do tasks and result in punishment for task failures, they are simply not too strong. Lin Chen didn't hesitate and immediately found a fishing rod to come over. After some thought, 
he straightened the hook at the end of the fishing line. To avoid catching fish and affecting the system's performance. The courtyard where Lin Chen resides was arranged by the holy master of the Ji family. The scenery is beautiful, with abundant spiritual energy, no less than the legitimate descendants within the clan. There is a small river murmuring in the backyard. Lin Chen found a small stool to sit down and threw the straight hook out. Emperor Qi leaks from the side, as if facing back to sentient beings, sitting on the emperor's coffin, suppressing unknown, fishing alone for eternity. About five minutes later, the fishing rod suddenly bent downwards. There seems to be something pulling down below. Lin Chen was quick-witted and quickly picked up the fishing rod. With a splash. Just above the straight hook, he caught a brilliant and colorful bubble from the small river. Fishing successful, located at the Ji family in the southern region. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the supreme bone. The item has been allocated to the system space and can be viewed by the host at any time. Lin Chen. What? Click to view item information. Supreme Bone. Born as a primitive treasure bone, possessing the primitive treasure technique of heavenly hand, and can strengthen physical fitness, comparable to ancient divine beasts. Anyone with this bone must be the supreme of the human race. I'm accusing you, it's actually the supreme bone of Sher Hao. It's truly a system, it's just such a heavyweight. Supreme, standing at the pinnacle of humanity, can be called the quasi-emperor in the world of obscurity. The strongest among them can even be compared to the ancient emperor, invincible in the field of humanity. The supreme bone not only provides powerful treasures, but also stunning physique and talent. And this is exactly what Lin Chen needs the most right now. As for the so dot called strongest theory of the mortal body, it is just a return to simplicity after being strong. Without talent, how can there be a powerful opportunity? Integrating the supreme bone, taking the first step on my invincible path. Without hesitation, Lin Chen opened the system space. Directly fused with the supreme bone. Suddenly. On a bone in Lin Chen's chest, a divine rune appeared. Extremely complex and profound, it seems to have endless Tao rhymes. That bone is undergoing transformation. Meanwhile, Lin Chen's body is also undergoing changes. Extraordinary energy is born in the blood, transforming into true blood and a powerful physique. The main hall of the Ji family. The holy master of the Ji family suddenly opened his eyes, his eyes radiating divine light, piercing through the void and looking east. Why did I vaguely sense a terrifying aura that made me feel a little palpitated? That direction is. The holy master of the Ji family, with his binocular powers, looked towards the source of oppression. But at this moment, the spiritual energy of heaven and earth suddenly erupted. The Ji family is located in a treasure trove, with countless dragon veins running through the underground. How rich is the spiritual energy? At this moment, they are converging in the same place, and there is a sign of being evacuated. Where's the spiritual energy? Why did the surrounding spiritual energy suddenly disappear? Look over there, all the spiritual energy is going there. Oh my goodness! The gathering of spiritual energy in the clouds is like the essence. Is it possible for a special treasure to be born? Could it be someone from the G family who is capable of breaking through and triggering celestial phenomena? Such a big commotion naturally alarmed everyone in the G family. The famous stay of the G family intends to glimpse the source. But as a result, I saw a ray of calamity, like a terrifying divine punishment descending from heaven, destroying all things. Mingsu screamed in pain, his eyes were injured, and he was bleeding profusely. Everywhere in the Ji family, strong individuals took to the sky, looking in horror at the gathering place of spiritual energy. At this moment, there is already endless darkness enveloping it, and ordinary people cannot approach it at all. The holy master of the Ji family exhausted his vision before he faintly saw the figure of the young man sitting among them. The runes on his body are shrouded in radiance, extremely extraordinary. 
That's the courtyard where Chinner lives. Such a vision, is it the awakening of the divine body. The Ji family has the eastern wilderness divine body, and when they were born, strange phenomena occurred frequently. The sea rises with a bright moon, and the holy silver shines everywhere. The vision triggered by Ko Linchen at this moment is even more terrifying than the divine body. The anomaly is still rapidly expanding. You can see the entire eastern wilderness and southern regions, with loot rolling over the Ji family. Runes emerge and interweave into hands, coming from outside the sky and capable of annihilating all things and all things. However, the next moment, the holy master of the Ji family took action. Use great power to unleash the void palm print to transform and eliminate anomalies. Seeing this scene, countless people were shocked. The Holy Lord actually took the initiative to dispel the illusion ahead of time. I don't want to draw everyone's attention to this, it seems to have a big impact. I have a premonition that there will be a peerless figure coming out of the G family soon. It has been thousands of years since the fall of the demon emperor of the demon clan. I think the G family can give birth to a second ancient emperor. Not bad, my G family has the eastern wilderness divine body. Who can compare to the arrogant eastern wilderness? End of this chapter. Chapter 2 Supreme Sea of Sorrow. Meet Ji Haoyue. You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 2 Supreme Sea of Sorrow. Meet Ji Haoyue. The Eastern Wilderness and Southern Regions. Although the vision was concealed by the Holy Master of the Ji family, it still attracted the attention of various forces. Yen State. The six great caves were alarmed. As a low dot level force in the southern region, the six major cave masters are not beyond the realm of the Dao Palace. Seeing the shocking vision in the southwest, the people of Dong Tian are all trembling. I can't imagine what exactly happened there. East. Shaking the Holy Land. In the magnificent palace, the shaking light saint frowned tightly. Ji family, another extraordinary figure has emerged. I don't know if it's the old guys breaking through, or the new ones showing their heads. Shaking light holy land, as the only two transcendent and powerful force in the southern region. It is inevitable to engage in open and covert struggles with the Ji family. The vision just now, whether it was a breakthrough by a strong member of the Ji family or the birth of a special physique. For the Shaking Light Holy Land, it's not good news. Next to the Shaking Light Holy Lord, there is also a couple of men and women. The man is exceptionally handsome, with a jade tree facing the wind. The woman is as graceful as a fairy, making even the bright jade treasures pale. Such a pure and ethereal temperament can only be possessed by saints and goddesses. Shaking the corners of the Holy Son's mouth revealed a meaningful smile. If it's a strong one, that's all. For newcomers. I'm looking forward to it. You are quite confident. Yao Shi, the Holy Maiden of Light, said. I didn't feel anything strange about the words of the Sheikh Light Holy Son. As the Holy Son and the future Holy Lord, he is a leading figure of the younger generation. How would one be afraid of others in the same generation? Yao Shi also had an invincible heart, even as he shook the Holy Son of Light. Therefore, Yao Shi did not realize the profound meaning implied in the words of the Sheikh Light Son. Ji's family. The courtyard is a mess. The walls built with rare ore are now cracking and collapsing. All the runes circulating on Lin Chen's body surface were converged into his body by him. His physique underwent a transformation. The bitter sea beneath the navel was originally extremely quiet, but now it is boiling. The sea of bitterness is profound, like the sea of runes, intertwined with orderly chains. Although the sea of suffering has not yet given birth to a different form, it is not necessarily weaker than the golden sea of suffering in the Holy Communion. The transformation of the Supreme Bone's constitution will naturally also affect the Sea of Suffering. The Golden Bitter Sea of the Holy Communion has infinite divine power and is difficult to exhaust. Lin Chen's current Sea of Suffering is like an inherent divine punishment, 
with a power no less than that of the true sea of suffering in its different forms. Perhaps it can be called the supreme sea of sorrow or the heavenly sea of sorrow. When it comes to power, it must also be the primitive treasure technique given by the supreme bone, the hand of the heavens. The innate supreme treasure technique. Unless the moves in the scriptures of the great emperor or the quasi emperor techniques are practiced to a high level. Otherwise, the same level cannot compete. Lin Chen felt a bit itchy and wanted to try the power of the supreme treasure technique. At this moment, someone flew and landed in the courtyard. The holy master of the Ji family stared at Lin Chen, as if his eyes could detect the illusion. Based on his cultivation level in the second layer of the Sendai heaven, it was evident at a glance that Lin Chen was different from before. My physique has really changed, I am extraordinary. Chenner, have you awakened your rare divine body? The holy master of the Ji family asked excitedly. Divine body. It seems so. I feel that my physique has become much stronger, and the difficult to open up sea of suffering is also restless. Lin Chen responded. After thinking about it, I still haven't mentioned the matter of the supreme bone. There is no such thing as the supreme bone in the world of covering the sky, and it is inevitable to encounter various troubles by directly explaining it. But without him needing to say anything, there was a sound coming from a distance, and it was clear with just one word. The physique is very strong, but by no means divine. A man in purple clothes flew into the courtyard, about twenty or so. The clothes fluttered and the momentum was majestic, like a heavenly god descending. At this point, many G family members had already arrived together, all attracted by the recent commotion. There are elders, high. Ranking elders, famous guests, as well as talented children of the G family. Upon hearing the man in purple say so, someone immediately agreed. Since the seventh young master said so, then it must not be a rare divine body. After all, the seventh young master has already formed his divine body, so I believe he can sense one or two. It's a pity, otherwise the G family has a dual divine body, who would be invincible. Observing the previous vision, even if Lin Chen is not a divine body, he is also a rare physique. Seven young masters, with the assistance of Lin Chen in the future, can sweep away all enemies. It's truly a blessing from heaven for my Ji family. Once the seventh young master achieves the title of Emperor of the Ancient, he will be invincible for another era. The seventh son of the Ji family is now the Donghuang Divine Body, Ji Haoyue, which is renowned in the southern region. Ji Haoyue was greatly praised by the members of the Ji family. He considers himself to have the power of a great emperor and will surely become emperor in this era. Therefore, even though Lin Chen's physique was extraordinary, Ji Haoyue's eyes still looked down upon him. He has never had a good impression of this non-Ji family member who has been staying at Ji's house. Isn't it a divine body? Yes, divine bodies are so rare. It's too difficult for two to be born. However, it is not easy for Chinner to awaken her special physique. The holy master of the Ji family smiled and said. Laughter is hearty, and the mood is incredibly joyful. Lin Chen's cultivation talent is extremely poor, which has always troubled him. Now that his physical condition has deteriorated, Lin Chen's future achievements are bound to be extraordinary. He also had an explanation for his long-lost old friend. Brother, do you think Lin Chen's awakening physique is strong, or your Dong Huang God physique is strong? Next to Ji Haoyue, a girl in purple asked. The girl is very beautiful, with big eyes that are lively and carry a fairy-like aura. It gives people a lively and lively feeling. Ji Ziyue, Ji Haoyue's sister. Although not as famous as the Dong Huang Divine Body, Ji Ziyue also possesses a special physique, which is an elemental spiritual body that is compatible with the Dharma. Therefore, she could feel the uniqueness of Lin Chen the most. The profound and profound feeling, as if reaching the true meaning of the Tao, made her heart palpitate. Even if Ji Haoyue's divine body was newly formed, she never felt like this. 
Ji Ziyue suspected it was her own illusion, so she asked Ji Haoyue. Regarding her question, Ji Haoyue's face showed displeasure. Ziyue, don't compare this kind of goods to me. I have just formed my divine body, and if he wants to assist me, he doesn't necessarily have that qualification. Ji Haoyue did not lower her voice. As if deliberately speaking to Lin Chen. Haoyue, shut up. The holy master of the Ji family spoke out and scolded. Lin Chen frowned slightly. Although I know that Ji Haoyue's nature is not bad, she is just young and energetic. But it has to be said that this guy really deserves to be beaten up in the early stages. Oh, shut up. Sure. If he can catch my move, I'll admit he has that qualification. What a joke. What realm are you in? What realm is Chinar in? How can you handle it? Holy Lord, rest assured that I will suppress the realm. That's not enough, even if suppressed to the realm of the bitter sea, it's a world of difference from a true cultivator in the bitter sea. The holy master of the Ji family said. I don't want Lin Chen to confront Ji Haoyue. Afraid of hurting Lin Chen, and also afraid of damaging his Tao heart. However, at this moment, Ji Haoyue ignored the holy master of the Ji family directly, her gaze fixed on Lin Chen like a sword. If it's a man, just take my move. Of course, if you dare not, I won't force it. Haoyue. Enough, uncle. The holy master of the Ji family still wants to say more. At this moment, Lin Chen took the initiative to speak and interrupted his words. Lin Chen looked at Ji Haoyue with a calm gaze. I have long heard of the famous Donghuang Divine Body, but I have never had the opportunity to compete. Since Brother Haoyue insists on fighting, why not take your move? End of this chapter. Chapter 3 Rising Sea and Bright Moon Hard to shake off a different appearance. You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 3 Rising Sea and Bright Moon Hard to shake off a different appearance. As soon as these words were spoken, the whole room was in an uproar. Everyone didn't expect that Lin Chen would take the initiative to fight. How dare you! Do you really think that awakening one's physique will make them invincible? You should know that Ji Haoyue has already formed her divine body, while Lin Chen has just started. Even if the realm is suppressed, it is impossible to resist the power of the divine body. Some people admire Lin Chen's courage. Some people also feel mocked, thinking that Lin Chen is overestimating himself and trying to save face. Chinner, you don't need to take on this battle. The holy master of the Ji family advises. Uncle, it's just a sparring. If we have to retreat even from this, even if we have an unparalleled divine body, how is it different from waste? Lin Chen said with a resolute tone. Seeing his resolute expression, the holy master of the Ji family hesitated slightly, sighed lightly, and did not stop him. On the path of cultivation, one can change one's destiny against the heavens, with countless difficulties and twists. Lin Chen said it well. I dare not even take on internal sparring within the clan. Even if my talent is strong, what achievements can I achieve in the future? Chen Er, since you insist on doing so, uncle won't say more. If you lose later, there's no need to be discouraged. You're still young, and the road ahead is still long. The holy master of the Ji family gave Lin Chen a preventive shot. Obviously, he didn't think Lin Chen could take Ji Haoyue's move, fearing that he wouldn't be able to accept the blow. In the eyes of the holy master of the Ji family, Lin Chen must be under immense pressure. But actually, Lin Chen's heart was filled with joy. Ji Haoyue has come so well. I am worried that there is no place to try. What does drowsiness mean? Sending pillows. The Donghuang Divine Body, which suppresses the realm, is simply the best test stone for the supreme treasure technique. As for whether to win or lose, Lin Chen doesn't really care. I have been a person for two generations and have been a waste cultivator for eighteen years. 
my temperament has already surpassed that of my peers. Surprisingly, you didn't continue to hide. You're not as miserable as I imagined. Chi Hao Yu said. There was a slight decrease in the contempt in his eyes. However, he still did not take Lin Chen seriously. Ji Haoyue didn't want anyone to compare him to Lin Chen. As the Eastern Wilderness Divine Body, I consider myself invincible among my peers. Today, Ji Haoyue wants to let everyone know how big the difference can be for those with the same special physique. The aura on Ji Haoyue's body rapidly declined, suppressing the body secrets in the Dao Palace and Four Poles. The Mingquan God Bridge has not been used, only the Kuhai Sea shows its power. However, even so, it still made some famous guests present feel heartbroken. The power of the Divine Body is extraordinary and incomparable to cultivators of the same rank. Even able to cross small boundaries and kill enemies. Lin Chen's eyes were deep and careless. The supreme sea of suffering surges within the body, ready to unleash divine power at any time. At the next moment, everyone was shocked. Night suddenly fell, and the surroundings were plunged into darkness. A strange scene appeared behind Ji Haoyue. The blue sea of bitterness surges and churns, and the holy moon rises slowly, scattering a little silver glow. The rising sea and bright moon. Everyone was shocked. This is an illusion cultivated in the Luanhai secret realm, with profound and unpredictable power. Ji Haoyue's move was actually referring to this. Seventh young master, when he comes up, he will unleash the illusion of the rising sea and the bright moon. It's really not giving him a chance. This is to crush the opponent and achieve victory with strength, in order to prove the name of Donghuang Divine Body. Lin Chen has been defeated. Apart from the innate restraint of the abyssal holy body, who else can resist it? Not to mention the mere bitterness of the sea, even the cultivators in Mingquan and Xinxiao realm will be beheaded. Undoubtedly, he is the first young generation of my Ji family, a saint-level figure. Lin Chen still has a long way to go to catch up with the seventh young master. Perhaps there will be a chance in a thousand years, but by no means now. As soon as the sea rises and the moon appears, everyone knows that the battle is over. No matter how strong Lin Chen's physique is, it is impossible to resist. Even if Ji Haoyue suppresses herself in the realm of suffering, it won't work. The spirit of the holy master of the Ji family is tense. Afraid of Ji Haoyue's heavy attack, she is ready to intervene at any time to stop. As for whether Lin Chen can take over. I have long lost hope. Brother is too bad. Isn't this bullying people? On the side. Ji Ziyue bulged her small cheeks. I originally wanted to see the confrontation between two constitutions, but I didn't expect Ji Haoyue to be so ruthless. Where is there someone who has just graduated from Jiaodong University? I'm not having fun watching now. Moonlight falls, seemingly gentle and soft, but Lin Chen can feel the ultimate killing intent within. If it were an ordinary cultivator in the bitter sea, he would die in an instant. Luanhai Yixiang, you really have enough respect for me. But since they are of the same rank, why not stop them? Roaming and rumbling, the supreme sea of suffering surges within Lin Chen's body, unleashing his divine power. The divine patterns born from the sea of suffering fly out, a total of eighteen. Form a divine sword in the air. This is a tool outlined by Lin Chen with the pattern of the Bitter Sea God, which is nothing special. But after the Bitter Sea transformed with the Supreme Bone, the power of the Divine Pattern also surged. The sword is powerful and knows no geometry, it can be called the Supreme Sword. The Divine Sword is cut out, and the sword's rays contain the power of Calamity Light, faintly revealing the Supreme Rune. Unexpectedly blocking the moonlight falling from a different phase. Undoubtedly, it is the supreme bone. Just the sword of the divine pattern is so powerful. Lin Chen was delighted. Everyone present was shocked. What kind of sword is that? It actually blocks the strange appearance of the rising sea and the bright moon. 
It's a device nurtured in the secret realm of the Luanhai Sea, how could this be possible? There is no otherness, just relying on the sword of the divine pattern, how can such power be obtained? Did the seventh young master leave his hand behind? That shouldn't have happened either. The rising sea and bright moon are rare in the world, and even a trace of power is comparable to a spiritual treasure. Isn't this to say that the tool outlined by Lin Chen with divine patterns already possesses the power of a spiritual treasure? It's unbelievable. What kind of constitution is this? The bitter sea divine pattern is so powerful. Even if we lose today, with Chinner's nature and talent, the future may not be weaker than Haoyue. The holy master of the Ji family is very pleased. Lin Chen's performance exceeded his imagination, no less than his divine body. Even if we can't connect to the other phase, so what? Even the great emperors of ancient times have never been defeated. Is my feeling right? His physique is really so extraordinary, even surpassing his divine body. Ji Ziyue's small mouth opened in an O-dot shape. When it comes to her realm of suffering, she would never be able to do such a thing. The Wheel Sea Abyss are a means that goes far beyond this realm and should not have appeared in the confrontation of the Kohai cultivators. Being able to block a trace of power is already shocking. How could the newly formed divine patterned artifact face my alien form directly? Ji Haoyue didn't expect it either. I thought that when a different form emerged, it would surely destroy and wither. The development of the matter exceeded his expectations. The difference in realm between the two sides is too great, even if the realm is suppressed, it cannot be considered a battle with the same realm. Not being able to instantly capture Lin Chen made Ji Haoyue feel a bit embarrassed. The rising moon over the sea is not just that. Just now, it was just a few glimpses of moonlight. I opened my eyes and saw clearly, what is a different appearance. The divine power of the bitter sea injects into the alien landscape. Ji Haoyue will no longer hold back and will immediately suppress Lin Chen. On the blue sea, the bright moon slowly sank. This is the strongest killing move of the rising sea and the moon in a different phase. Legend has it that the bright moon can tear apart the sky and silence the mountains and seas. Even if Lin Chen's physique is extraordinary, he will be defeated. End of this chapter Chapter 4 Supreme Treasure Technique The Hand of the Heavens You are listening at Novel Full Audio. Chapter 4 Supreme Treasure Technique The Hand of the Heavens Silver shimmers and falls, accompanied by the bright moon, swirling and becoming increasingly dense. Lin Chen's divine pattern sword was trembling. This newly developed tool cannot compete with others in the end. It's over. Ji Haoyue let out a loud shout, as if it were a divine will. No one dares to comply. The bright moon fell heavily, like a curved blade, and pressed down like a giant mountain. To tear apart Lin Chen's body and crush his divine consciousness. The sword of the divine pattern was knocked away, and its light was dim and difficult to resist. The outcome is already predetermined. Although Lin Chen's performance exceeded everyone's expectations. Still unable to block Ji Haoyue's supernatural powers. But just when everyone thinks so. In Lin Chen's chest, there was suddenly a thunderous sound, as if the sea was majestic. The momentum is getting bigger and bigger, even starting to tremble in the sky and earth. A rune flew out of Lin Chen's chest, dazzling and exceptionally brilliant, forming an illusory palm. On the palm of your hand, countless divine lights envelop you, claiming to be the most terrifying divine punishment in the world. Heaven robs you of light. Supreme Art, the Hand of the Heavens Faced with the pressure of Ji Haoyue, Lin Chen decisively cast the treasure technique given by the Supreme Bone. The bright moon and silver light fell, and in an instant, they were engulfed by plunder. The light of the heavens can destroy all things, and the different forms of the wheel sea are no exception. The unreal hand lifted up and lifted the sunken bright moon life. What? Everyone was stunned. 
you should not believe that everything in front of you is true. What divine power is Lin Chen using? Surprisingly able to directly block the peerless appearance of the rising moon from the sea. Surprisingly caught it. How could that be? Ji Hao Yue's heart and mind were greatly shaken. This strike has already unleashed the divine power of the rising sea and the moon in a different form. In theory, it is enough to sweep across the same realm without any enemies. But the reality is that Lin Chen took over. Ji Hao Yue even felt that her bright moon was trembling, with signs of being shattered. That kind of calamity is even more terrifying than the alien form, even more mysterious, with a terrifying source. Break it. The sound of forest dust shook all directions. The power of the bitter sea is being rapidly extracted and absorbed by the hands of the heavens. As the bright moon was about to fall, Ji Hao Yue's subconscious strengthened and she was in a different state. There is a second bright moon brewing in the night sky. And the power of the spring of life is also surging, dissipating strands. Ji Hao Yue has broken through the barrier of the realm and is using the spring of life to activate the alien form. However, it is still useless. The hand of heaven, intertwined with runes, breaks through the night sky. The bright moon was torn apart and fell from high altitude. The strange appearance of the rising sea and the bright moon was torn apart by the dust of the forest. Ji Hao Yue's body suddenly retreated, blood overflowing from the corners of her mouth, and her eyes were filled with fear. What kind of secret technique are you? How could you suppress my rising sea and moon? A natural secret technique, the hand of heaven. Thanks to brother Hao Yue, I realize the true meaning of this constitution in adversity. Lin Chen calmly said. Until now, all the members of the Ji family seem to have just realized and felt incredulous. What happened just now? Lin Chen, he, he. He blocked the seven young masters' appearance. What's more, it's blocking. Seven young masters have been forced to retreat, and his appearance has been torn open by his big hands. A natural secret technique, is there such a divine body in the world? No, it's even more terrifying than a divine body. Before the ancient times, there was a sacred body that was unparalleled. After the ancient times, did a new invincible physique emerge. Born to be able to suppress the ancient great powers different forms, or it can be called the imperial body. That's right, the awakened young master Lin Chen is definitely an atheistic entity with the power of the great emperor. The crowd, who had just returned with various disdains, underwent a 360 degree change in attitude. The sound of young master Lin Chen almost rushed up to hug Lin Chen's thigh. Cut. A group of snobbish eyes. Ji Ziyue muttered. I think these people are just losing face with the Ji family. What imperial style? Isn't it just a natural talent, a natural secret technique? Her elemental spiritual body may not necessarily be worse than Lin Chen. Ji Ziyue thought to herself, tears still flowed from the corner of her mouth. She saw the secret technique that Lin Chen had just used the most vividly. The rules are incredibly terrifying. She only felt a similar feeling on the extreme weapon of the Ji family. Although there is a huge gap between the two, Lin Chen's secret technique has an absolutely high level of power. Overcoming the different forms of the Wheel Sea, one can easily cross a major secret realm and slay powerful enemies. What Dong Huang Divine Body and Yuan Spirit Body are simply incomparable. Ji Ziyue is almost crying. On the side, the holy master of the Ji family was also not calm. Even as a great expert and knowledgeable, it is difficult to conceal one's shock. Who has seen this scene before? How Yue finally used the power of the spring of life, but the different forms of the wheel see were still shattered. Chinner, you're going against the sky. The holy master of the Ji family sighed. Immediately, Lin Chen's body suddenly shook and he quickly stepped forward to support it. Chinner, are you okay? No problem, it's just that the power consumption is too high and there's some detachment. Lin Chen explained. 
The consumption of the supreme treasure technique is too high, and at his current level, it is still too difficult to use. With just one blow, his bitter sea divine power was exhausted. However, the power of the hand of the heavens really satisfied Lin Chen. Breaking through different realms is a miracle. Opposite. Ji Haoyue's face turned red with shame and unwillingness. I actually lost, to a bitter sea cultivator. How could it be like this? How could it be like this? Although it was just a trick that was broken, in Ji Haoyue's opinion, it was a loss. His realm is already high, and he even uses the power of the fountain of life in the final moments. But the result was that Lin Chen couldn't be suppressed and was instead forced to retreat. What is this not about losing? If Lin Chen also sets foot in the Four Extremes realm, wouldn't he be defeated by the opponent? As a highly anticipated and I dot catching Dong Huang divine body. This kind of humiliation is going to make Ji Hao Yue collapse. Brother, don't think too much. You didn't perform so many moves and suppressed your cultivation. Losing one move is not a big deal. Ji Ziyue comforted her. Shut up. Ji Hao Yue scolded. Scared, Ji Ziyue's eyes were filled with tears and her heart was filled with grievances. He comforted you with kindness, but surprisingly, he was still ferocious. Seven big bad guys. At this moment, Lin Chen's voice came from across. Miss Ziyue is right, it's just a confrontation. Brother Hao Yue doesn't need to worry. Are you humiliating me? Ji Hao Yue's gaze condensed. No, I know Brother Hao Yue's bright moon has a total of nine turns, and I am exhausted. If I continue, I will inevitably be defeated. Not to mention Brother Hao Yue suppressed his own realm. If it weren't for that, defeating me would be easy. The realm is originally cultivated by oneself, and there is no such thing as big deceiving small. In this world, only strength is the way. Even if you walk outside, the enemy won't show mercy just because your realm is low. So, what's the point of failing to suppress the realm? Lin Chen's words left everyone in the Ji family silent. Even Ji Hao Yue was momentarily stunned, speechless. It seems like this truth is roaring. Chen Er is right. It's just a sparring competition, and the path of cultivation is still long. Don't stop because of a little obstacle. The holy master of the Ji family said. Looking at Lin Chen's gaze, there was a hint of appreciation. I didn't expect my virtuous nephew to have such a high mood. If it were someone else, and they still took advantage of the eastern wilderness divine body, their tail would not be able to fly up to the sky. It is truly rare for Lin Chen to be able to remain calm and composed. The holy master of the Ji family is thinking so. As a result, Lin Chen's next sentence was to let him live in Bungbu. End of this chapter. Chapter 5 Surprisingly tests cadres with this. You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 5 Surprisingly Tests Cadres with This. As my uncle said, the path of cultivation is still long. Brother Hao Yue should work hard to cultivate and not be overtaken by me unconsciously. Lin Chen smiled and said. Change the previous calm and introverted demeanor. This is absolutely crazy. Surprisingly, he openly provoked Ji Hao Yue and threatened to surpass him in the future. The holy master of the Ji family's face turned black. Lin Chen, this little brat, is afraid that the situation won't be big enough. But when he wanted to dissuade Ji Hao Yue from letting the situation worsen further. But to his surprise, Ji Hao Yue did not explode like he had imagined. However, the expression remained cold and proud. You can give it a try. I look forward to fighting in the same realm as you. But I don't think there should be that opportunity. Say it. Ji Hao Yue turned around and left, as if flames were rising in her eyes. Hmm, Seven Brother is serious. Does this really see Lin Chen as an opponent? Lin Chen can do it. Compared to Seventh Brother, he's just as crazy. 
Is this just the mutual admiration between Tianjiao? Ji Ziyue muttered to herself. I feel that today's impression of Lin Chen has been overturned countless times. Is this still the little transparent person who used to mix food and drink at Ji's house? It feels like a different person. As Ji Haoyue left, everyone in the Ji family followed Lin Chen for a while and then dispersed. As long as there's no more conflict, Chinner, you're really getting bolder. But you really did a great job this time, even Haoyue suffered a loss. Just say what cultivation resources you need in the future, but some members of the clan dare not say anything more. The holy master of the Ji family said, his face almost bursting with laughter. As long as Lin Chen grows up, the Ji family will once again emerge as a peerless pride, not inferior to the divine body. Thank you very much, uncle. If it weren't for uncle's care, Chen'er wouldn't have been today. Lin Chen said. I have great respect for the holy master of the Ji family. For eighteen years, if it weren't for the protection of the other party, he had already been expelled from the Ji family, and his life and death were unknown. After learning that Lin Chen had no talent for cultivation, the holy master of the Ji family never spared resources and always responded to every request. The holy master of the Ji family nodded in relief. Looking around at the collapsed and messy courtyard, he spoke again. Chinner, you can't live in this courtyard anymore. I will immediately send someone to fix it. Before that, you can temporarily. Well, stay at Ziyue's place for now. Ah. Ji Ziyue, who had not yet left, heard the words of the holy master of the Ji family and immediately let out a surprise. Lin Chen was also taken aback and looked at the holy master of the Ji family with suspicion. Uncle, what does this mean? What does it all depend on me? That's the decision. Chinner, please keep an eye on Ziyue and practice more on a daily basis. Don't just play around all day. Say it. The holy master of the Ji family transformed into a rainbow and disappeared into the sky. Surprisingly, he just left like this. Leave Lin Chen and Ji Ziyue in chaos in the local wind. Why didn't you see before that uncle was so old and indecent? Lin Chen muttered to himself in his heart. Who knows the thoughts of the holy master of the Ji family? This is to match him and Ji Ziyue. Ji Ziyue carries the elemental spirit body and is friendly with the Dharma. At the age of fifteen or sixteen, he is already a cultivator in the realm of the Tao Palace, comparable to the master of the heavenly and blessed land. Placed in other sacred places, it can be called a saint. Releasing such a large bait, uncle is really willing. If others know about it, they might envy Kiel so much that he turns purple. Ji Ziyue looked at Lin Chen, her fair cheeks revealing a faint blush. Previously, Lin Chen was just a useless person with low cultivation, so she naturally didn't pay attention. Today, upon closer inspection, I realize that this guy is so handsome. Ji Haoyue can be called charming and charming, but compared to Lin Chen, she is still inferior. It's not an exaggeration to say it's unparalleled. No, no, no. What am I thinking? I, Ji Ziyue, will crown the world with beauty and conquer the country. In the future, I will become an unparalleled female immortal. Just a bitter sea cultivator, where do I deserve to be? Ji Ziyue raised her proud little head, playful and cute. I originally wanted Lin Chen to find a place to live on his own. Looking at his elegant and handsome face, with a jade tree facing the wind, I hesitated a bit. After thinking for a moment, he said, Since the Lord has said so, you can come with me. Don't misunderstand anything, Mississippi. I just saw that you have good talent and are a capable person. I just want to take on a follower. Ji Ziyue said with a stiff tongue. Lin Chen has been a person for two generations, why can't you tell what her thoughts are? Clearly, it's just craving for one's own body. It's so shameless. However, since it was his uncle's intention, Lin Chen could only reluctantly accept it. Lin Chen didn't have much and quickly moved into Ji Ziyue's courtyard. 
Lin Chen, do you want to go out with me? I've made a few friends and they're all very interested in you. As the holy master of the Ji family said, Ji Ziyue has great fun playing. Not long after returning, I will be pulling Lin Chen and running outside. Lin Chen naturally has no interest. Studying the supreme bone, practicing, fishing he has too much to do and can't tolerate wasting any time. I have some insights from the battle just now. I need to meditate for a period of time. Miss Siyue, let's go alone. Lin Chen politely declined. Ji Ziyue puffed her cheeks and felt that Lin Chen was not giving her face as a future fairy. With a purr in his eyes, he grinned mischievously and said, I even made plans with a few good girlfriends, all of whom are beautiful women. Along the way of cultivation, transcending the mortal world, women will only affect the speed of my cultivation. Lin Chen is a serious person. Not at all swayed by the temptation of Ji Ziyue. Surprisingly, I underestimated the cadre by testing him with this. Cut, it's boring. Are you those bald donkeys from the western desert? Ji Ziyue bit her red lips, revealing a pair of cute little tiger teeth. I think Lin Chen is too unintelligent. After thinking for a moment, he opened his mouth and bit Lin Chen's ear. Lin Chen couldn't react and was bitten straight by her. What are you doing? I just want to bite you, this is punishment for you. Are you sure this is punishment? Lin Chen was a bit speechless, I didn't expect girls nowadays to be so open. Come up so intimate. With such a commotion, Ji Ziyue seemed to have calmed down and bounced out of the yard. Lin Chen didn't think much and began to try to break through the realm. The holy master of the Ji family has already sent people to deliver the herbs and spiritual medicines needed for various levels of suffering. The ancient family has a profound heritage, and the Bai Chao liquid used in the cave is only the most inferior. There are also various rare medicines that were born in dangerous places, which are difficult for ordinary cultivators to obtain. However, at this time, large areas are placed in front of Lin Chen. Lin Chen attempted to refine his modified physique, and the difficulty of cultivation unexpectedly decreased significantly. In the past, even with the provision of resources, his suffering sea was difficult to transform. At this moment, the supreme sea of sorrow is crazily absorbing the medicinal power from the great medicine, transforming into life essence and swirling above the sea of sorrow. In just half a day, the essence of life has converged and transformed into a new divine pattern. If we continue at this speed, we can break through the sea of suffering and enter the realm of the spring of life in at most one month. This speed is amazing, and only the supreme bone can transform one's physique. Looking at the nineteen divine patterns floating above the bitter sea, Lin Chen was very satisfied. And soon, he realized that his body was undergoing some kind of change. The runes in the supreme bone are actively transforming into the body, transforming into rays of light and divine radiance. A force also emerged within Lin Chen's body. This is The Blood Realm End of this chapter Chapter 6 The Wishers Take the Hook Only Fishing for Purple and Moon You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 6 The Wishers Take the Hook Only Fishing for Purple and Moon After realizing what kind of change had happened to his body, Lin Chen's heart was stirred up, causing a huge wave. The realm of moving blood, using essence and blood to refine bone culture, giving birth to divine radiance in the blood, refining the creation of heaven and earth, and strengthening one's own body. This is the cultivation method of the perfect world, the starting point of cultivation in the field of humanity. Lin Chen has already practiced the sky covering technique and had no intention of doing so. Unexpectedly, the supreme bone took the initiative to nourish his body with bone culture, equivalent to independently cultivating the realm of moving blood. The supreme bone is the spiritual constitution of a perfect world. Is it because it integrates with the supreme bone that I have the talent to practice both the heavenly covering method and the perfect method at the same time? Double system co-cultivation, this kind of thing is simply unbelievable. 
once successful, what kind of power will there be? In the same realm, one will inevitably be invincible again. After realizing this, Lin Chen immediately began to actively cultivate the realm of moving blood. Absorb medicinal power to nourish the body, allowing it to quickly combine with the supreme bone script, giving birth to the divine light. At the same time, the bitter sea is also boiling and constantly giving birth to new life essence. Lin Chen practiced the Wheel Sea chapter of the Void Sutra, which is the scripture of the Great Emperor and taught by the Holy Master of the Ji family. Since the beginning of the Bitter Sea, we must forge a solid foundation, which consumes a lot. Using the bone script of the Supreme Bone to cultivate the realm of moving blood is also incomparable to ordinary bone script practitioners. Various rare medicines are being consumed crazily, and Lin Chen's cultivation speed has noticeably slowed down. Even Lin Chen vaguely felt that even the large medicine provided by the Ji family could not meet his consumption. If there is a higher quality rare treasure medicine, the cultivation speed can definitely be further improved. If I ask my uncle for it, he probably won't be stingy. But after all, I am not a child of the Ji family. My uncle's various forms of protection will bring pressure from other members of the Ji family. It's time to try the Zhutian fishing system again. Lin Chen naturally did not forget about the system. The supreme bone obtained from fishing has almost transformed his entire body, proving the value of the system. However, the system also said that the first fishing reward is the best, and subsequent fishing rewards will have to be tried before we know. There is also a small river in Ji Ziyue's courtyard. Lin Chen picked up a small stool, sat down by the river, picked up the fishing rod, and threw the straight hook out. About ten minutes had passed this time, and the fishing rod was lifted with force. Lin Chen immediately stopped fishing and found that what was caught this time was a colorless transparent bubble. Fishing successful, located at the Ji family in the southern region. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the Millennium Willow Heart. The item has been allocated to the system space and can be viewed by the host at any time. Lin Chen's eyebrows twitched. View item information. Millennium Willow Heart. The spiritual core of Millennium Grass and Trees. Taking it can greatly increase cell activity and cause a transformation in physical fitness. In the system space, a yellow crystal wrapped in vines floats in the air. Seeing the appearance of this thing, Lin Chen was completely certain of what it was. From devouring the starry world, a rare spiritual object that can shape the god of war powerhouse. The weakest god of war has a fist power of 64 tons, which is 128,000 pounds. It's comparable to the extreme realm of moving blood, and the realm of the bitter sea is even less powerful than the holy body. In this comparison, the medicinal power contained in the heart of a thousand-year-old willow tree can be imagined. Even for subsequent fishing, one can obtain such a treasure. The system is like a system, it's simply too powerful. Using the thousand-year-old willow wood heart as the main medicine, it is enough for me to cultivate to the extreme realm of moving blood and the realm of life spring. But in order to establish a solid foundation, we need to be more cautious. Lin Chen didn't stop and continued fishing. Then there were several more catches, all of which were transparent bubbles. The reward for this type of bubble is often not as good as that of colored bubbles, which only appear when fishing for the first time. Fishing successful, located at the Ji family in the southern region. Congratulations to the host for obtaining Yao Shi's divine silk bra. Fishing successful, location. Nanyu Ji's house. Congratulations to the host for obtaining Yasina's private photo collection. Fishing successful, location. Nanyu Ji's house. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the fallen angel Gonko made costume. What? How did this system start to be unprofessional? Lin Chen opened the photo album and continued fishing while enjoying it. Fishing successful, located at the Ji family in the southern region. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the true blood of the golden winged Dapeng. Fishing successful, located at the Ji family in the southern region. 
Congratulations to the host for obtaining the Earth Immortal Spring. Fishing alone for eternity knows no time. Unconsciously, it was already late at night. Gzuf fell into the courtyard from outside, floating like an immortal, sinking fish and falling geese. As soon as I arrived, I saw Lin Chen fishing by the river. Lin Chen, aren't you going to practice? I'm sorry that the Holy Master asked you to keep an eye on me for cultivation. Do you believe me to report it to me? Gzue laughed mischievously. I think Lin Chen was secretly fishing and was caught by myself. Immediately, she showed a puzzled expression again. Lin Chen, how do you use a straight hook when fishing? And it's also three feet away from the water. Are you afraid you're not practicing foolishly? Ji Ziyue asked, with a silly expression on her face. Lin Chen, on the other hand, didn't take it seriously and said calmly, I'm Lin Chen fishing, and I wish someone would take the bait. It's better to seek in the straight than in the curved. Not for the golden scales, only for the purple and the moon. You see, isn't this just taking the bait? With these words, Ji Ziyue became confused. What took the bait? Although I didn't understand, it feels really impressive. It wasn't until Lin Chen finished and returned to the house that Ji Ziyue realized the profound meaning of Lin Chen's last sentence. Suddenly, her pretty face turned red. You Lin Chen, how dare you tease me? Come out, miss I'm going to fight you for 300 rounds tonight. Being harassed by Ji Ziyue for a while. The next day, Lin Chen got up exhausted. Thanks to the miraculous effect of the supreme bone in repairing injuries. Otherwise, if you have bruises and bruises on your face, you won't be able to see anyone. It's too much of a girl like Ziyue to hit someone without hitting her face. When I break through the realm of the Dao Palace, let you kneel and call, Dad, Dot. Lin Chen set a small goal for himself, full of motivation. Open the system space and he will take out the various treasures he caught yesterday. There are many precious medicines among them, such as Millennium Willow Heart, Golden Wing Dapeng True Blood, and Earth Immortal Spring. There are also weapons, but the level is relatively average, such as the Eight Spider Spear from Dolua World. The external soul bone can be directly absorbed by the human body as a weapon for killing and attacking. But fusing this thing with his own bones, Lin Chen really looks down on it. Just the upper limit of Dolua's combat power. To put it bluntly, it sounds like a hydrogen gas man, but to put it nicely, it explodes into the sky. Lin Chen carries the supreme bone, and if he were to melt the eight spider spears again, it would truly lower the upper limit. The supreme bone is at least broken and can continue to regenerate and transform, and the eight spider spear can only be used in the early stage. So, without even thinking, Lin Chen directly refined the eight spider spears into a weapon. The power is quite good, but the cultivator Luanhai is difficult to resist and can threaten the strong in the Dao Palace realm. Next, start strengthening yourself and breaking through boundaries. No matter how many treasures there are, without strength, they are all empty. We need to convert resources into strength as soon as possible. Lin Chen did not blindly fish, knowing that his own strength is the hard truth. Now the cultivation resources are sufficient. The shell of the thousand-year-old willow tree heart was pierced by him, and from it flowed out the jade dew, containing astonishing life energy. The golden-winged rock is an ancient ferocious beast. True blood is the essence of essence. Dixian spring comes from the world on the other side of the deep sky and has a miraculous effect of extending life for fifty years. It is also a great treasure medicine. The precious medicine obtained from fishing, combined with various large medicines provided by the Ji family, made Lin Chen feel like he was in a fairyland. Bones on the body are flowing everywhere, and the wheel of life is vibrating. It seems like a volcano is reviving and about to erupt. Lin Chen's expertise in the two realms of moving blood and suffering the sea rapidly climbed, end of this chapter. Chapter 7 Breaking Through the Spring of Life Move blood to the extreme realm. You are listening at novelfull.audio.
Chapter 7 Breaking Through the Spring of Life Move blood to the extreme realm. In the blink of an eye, a month has passed. This month, Lin Chen has become a hot topic of discussion in the Ji family. Although it cannot be said to defeat the divine body. But breaking the sea rising bright moon of Ji Haoyue in the same realm is still astonishing. Countless girls embrace spring and have various fantasies about Lin Chen. Some young children also yearn for a sudden awakening of their physical fitness one day. At the same time, the news of the natural emperor's body is also spreading everywhere. The news even spread to some major eastern wilderness powers and became known to the people. The Taishian Gate is a great sect located in the eastern part of the Wei Kingdom, with 108 main peaks of the immortal mountains within the gate. At its peak, its strength ranked among the top 100 in the entire Donghuang region, second only to supernatural powers such as the Holy Land. Xingfeng is one of the 108 main peaks with extremely strong strength, ranking among the top three. Among the disciples of this generation of Xingfeng, Hua Yunfei, the young grandson of Xingfeng's master, is even more powerful than the other contemporaries of the Taishian sect. The strength of talent can compete with the Holy Sun. A natural secret, without a divine body. Hua Yunfei learned this news from the master of Xingfeng. Deep in the eye, a divine radiance blooms. He is the descendant of the heavenly swallowing demon technique of the ruthless emperor, capable of devouring the essence of others and strengthening himself. The stronger the strength and unique the physique of the person being devoured, the greater their improvement. A godless body that has not yet grown up, in his eyes, is simply a humanoid treasure medicine. Unfortunately, the Ji family is not a place for me to step on. Only when Lin Chen's cultivation is successful and he is born will he have some opportunities. Hua Yunfei sighed in his heart. Seeing him seem a bit lonely, the Lord of Star Peak thought he had been hit. You don't need to compare with him, physique doesn't determine everything. Among the ancient emperors, there were also those who demonstrated the Tao with mortal bodies. The Lord of Star Peak comforted. Hua Yunfei nodded and restrained all his thoughts in his heart. Swallowing the heavenly demon technique is a taboo. Once exposed, one will be killed by everyone in the world. Speaking of which, within the territory of Yen, there are rumors that the tomb of the demon emperor has emerged. Hua Yunfei brought up this matter, and the news came not long ago, which had already shaken the entire east wilderness. That is the land of the eastern wilderness, the last emperor to unify the demon race. He was also the first person to prove himself as an emperor in the post-wasteland era. What amazing treasures and secrets should be found in the tomb of the ancient emperor. Even the holy land and ancient aristocratic families cannot sit still, they are sending strong men to rush. However, the Lord of Star Peak shook his head. The tomb of the ancient emperor is not a holy land and should not be touched by ancient aristocratic families. Otherwise, even if there is gain, it will be a great disaster. Inside the Ji family courtyard. Lin Chen sat cross-legged, his body sparkling and translucent, as if carved from jade. Surrounded by a hazy halo on the surface of the body, a supreme bone inscription emerges. The wheel of life rumbled in the lower abdomen, the bitter sea boiled, and a divine spring gushed out from it. Ji Ziyue was on the side, and Shui Lingling's big eyes stared at Lin Chen, feeling a bit confused. This guy, where is the Minquan cultivator? After a month, breaking through the Minquan realm is enough. The powerful aura, even I have some palpitations, I have never seen such a twisted realm of life spring. Lin Chen's body emitted loud noises, like the roar of a tiger and the roar of a dragon. After a long time, he restrained his breath. Is this the true meaning of, moving blood realm? Lin Chen whispered. This month, he has been continuously using various large and precious medicines to refine himself. Besides, he almost enters the mountains and forests near the Ji family every day to fight against monsters. Accelerate the transformation of the body through slaughter and bloodshed. At this moment, even if he doesn't actively stimulate the secret power of blood transfer, 
his body will naturally appear radiant. This is composed of powerful chi and blood, which self-derive and protect the body. The extreme realm of 100,000 pounds can only be achieved by the offspring of the heavenly rank ancient fierce beast. At this moment, I weigh 108,000 pounds with just one swing of my arm, stronger than the young beasts of ancient times. Not only does it rely on various true blood and precious medicines to nourish, but also thanks to the supreme bone, it greatly accelerates the speed of cultivation. Lin Chen was overjoyed in his heart. This incredible talent may gradually fade and lose its effectiveness in the later stages. But at the beginning of cultivation, the effect is undoubtedly extremely strong, which can greatly shorten the growth time. In addition to breaking through the extreme realm by moving blood, Lin Chen's bitter sea has also given birth to the stock god spring, breaking through to the realm of the life spring. A sword made up of sixty intertwined divine patterns, continuously refined by Lin Chen using the scriptures of the Void Sutra and the Supreme Bone Script. Although unable to truly imprint it, it still makes the divine pattern sword appear extremely extraordinary. It's time to consider collecting various rare minerals and truly start forging my tools. In the future, this will be an unparalleled immortal weapon that surpasses the Emperor's sword and can slay immortals. Lin Chen stood up and finished this month of hard work. Both the large medicine sent by the Holy Master of the Ji family and the resources he caught fishing have been consumed to a great extent. The cultivation speed is fast, but the cost is also shocking, and even the same level holy body cannot compare. Practitioner Maniac, is this finally over? Ji Ziyue asked. This month, I feel like I've met Lin Chen again. This guy is just a cultivator, either fighting monsters or practicing all day long. She has also been somewhat affected these days, and her cultivation frequency has increased significantly compared to before. Lin Chen nodded. Looking at Ji Ziyue with fiery eyes, she suddenly spoke, Ziyue, give me a punch. Say it. Not giving Ji Ziyue a chance to reply, Lin Chen punched out. The skin and body surface are shrouded in runes, and the divine spring is surging. The explosive force is not just 180,000 kilograms. The power of the life spring is unleashing, and the fist's power is terrifying. Lin Chen, if you don't talk about martial arts, you should have attacked me secretly. Ji Ziyue Jiao called out. I almost didn't react and quickly used the secret technique. A black palm print was inspired by her, which is a technique recorded in the Void Sutra called the Void Big Hand Print. Ji Ziyue used her cultivation level in the Mingquan realm to activate this move, fearing that it would harm Lin Chen. But the power is still terrifying, and the incomplete understanding of the imperial law also possesses supreme power. Bang! Lin Chen launched a heavy punch, facing the black handprint. Inspired by the blood runes nourished by the supreme bone, the power breaks through the extreme realm. Surprisingly, it shook the handprint of the void. The ripples echoed around, and Ji Ziyue quickly intervened to protect the courtyard from being destroyed. Lin Chen withdrew his hand, and the aerial fingerprints also dissipated, wearing away their power. Ji Ziyue's beautiful eyes widened in disbelief. How could it be? Your punch just now actually erased my void big handprint. She could see very clearly that Lin Chen had just made a simple punch. No method or secret technique was used. But it erased the void handprint she displayed, which is a technique recorded in the Emperor's classic. Even if her understanding of this move is only superficial, she cannot comprehend the true meaning of the imperial law. Lin Chen's punch is still unbelievable. What's impossible? If you lower it ten times with one force, you can break through all the laws and paths with one force. Lin Chen said that he was not surprised by his own strength. If he wants, he can even forcibly break through his fingerprints and continue to attack and kill Ji Ziyue. Humph, I'm not satisfied. Come again. Ji Ziyue smiled mischievously, clearly intending to bully others based on her realm. Lin Chenjing wants to educate this girl without using the supreme treasure technique. 
The next moment, the land of the Ji family suddenly shook. Roaming and rumbling, Ji Ziyue stumbled and originally pretended to extend her claws towards Lin Chen, but ended up throwing herself directly into his arms. And over the Ji family, a majestic golden ancient chariot was pulled up by nine blue dragons. End of this chapter Chapter 8 Female Rogue Demon Emperor Tomb You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 8 Female Rogue Demon Emperor Tomb Zhou Jiao pulled the cart, it was uncle's clan uncle. In such a hurry, what happened? Lin Chen frowned slightly and realized that something big had happened. Immediately after, a refreshing fragrance hit my face, and a soft feeling came from my chest. This pulled Lin Chen's thoughts back and instinctively hugged Ji Ziyue's slender waist. You, you. What are you doing? Ji Ziyue exclaimed, immediately pushing Lin Chen away. How powerful is Lin Chen, who can break through the extreme realm of moving blood? The same level of communion cannot be matched. Although Ji Ziyue is a cultivator in the Dao Palace realm, her strength mainly comes from various divine powers and Taoist techniques. The elemental spirit body is not a physical condition that excels in close combat. For a moment, he couldn't break free from Lin Chen's arms. What am I doing? Even though you took the initiative to embrace me, why did you blame me instead? Lin Chen said. I am very dissatisfied with Ji Ziyue's attitude of asking for help and punishment. As the daughter of Ji Yanji, the young head of the Ji family, and the younger sister of Dong Huang Shenti, Ji Ziyue said that she gathers countless favors in one body, which inevitably leads to some being spoiled. Lin Chen felt that this would not work. Since Lin Chen had high expectations from his uncle, he felt it was necessary to train his elders well Ah Ba, it's educating this girl. Lin Chen did not let go of his arm and held Ji Ziyue in his arms. Both of them could clearly feel each other's temperature. Although Lin Chen didn't want to hurt her and didn't hold her tightly, she still made Ji Ziyue feel embarrassed and annoyed. Lin Chen, hurry up and let go. I'm not relaxed, didn't you just disagree? Then you can break free on your own. Stinky thug, I'll bite you to death, Mississippi. Hey. Where are you biting? I think you're a female hooligan. Humph. I'll bite. It's your lucky fate to die at the mouth of this fairy today. Okay, then I won't be too polite. Let's see what we can do. Ah. Lin Chen, you bastard, how dare you. I fought with you. Within the courtyard. The two fought together, and the commotion subsided for a while. When they parted ways, both of them were very disheveled and disheveled. At this moment, the holy master of the Ji family happened to come and saw the scene inside the courtyard, and her aunt's smile immediately appeared on her face. Young people nowadays are so full of blood and vitality. Surprisingly, during the broad daylight. Cough, if you continue, I won't disturb you. Uncle, wait. Seeing that Ji Jiaxing was mainly going, Lin Chen quickly called out. Ji Ziyue also spoke almost simultaneously, wanting to explain. Ko Lin Chen spoke faster and didn't even care about what the Lord had misunderstood. Uncle, what happened? I see that Grandpa Wen seems to be in a hurry. Ji Wen Dao, a clan uncle of the Holy Master of the Ji family, holds an extraordinary position in the Ji family. I have great abilities in cultivation, and throughout the entire southern region, I can't find any opponents. It must be an extremely significant event that can disturb him. Especially when Lin Chen knew the plot in advance, there was a major event in his memory that was related to this Holy Lord clan uncle. In the history of the demon tribe, the last demon emperor's tomb was born. Unfortunately, the news came too late, otherwise my Ji family would be the closest, and I might have enjoyed the demon emperor's tomb alone. The holy master of the Ji family said, feeling very regretful. At first, the Ji family who discovered the tomb of the demon emperor thought it was an ordinary treasure trove. 
who would have thought that the legendary demon emperor's tomb would be born? Now, the news has spread throughout the eastern wilderness, and major holy sites and ancient aristocratic families are inevitably rushing to them. Indeed, it is the tomb of the demon emperor. Lin Chen's heart was throbbing. That is the tomb of Emperor Qing, the first person to prove the existence of Emperor Cheng in the post-ancient times. The red-haired monster once said, Yi Fan, the youth has no beginning, comparable to ruthless people, comparable to the Qing Emperor. The strength of the Qing Emperor is evident, even among the great emperors of ancient times, he is a stunningly talented person. In his tomb, there are many precious treasures such as the Wheel Sea chapter of the Dao Jing, the Wild Pagoda, and the Chaos Green Lotus. Lin Chen felt that he couldn't miss it. Not to mention whether there is a chance to obtain the precious treasure of the Demon Emperor. Going fishing at the Demon Emperor's tomb alone is an experience that cannot be missed. As a qualified fisherman, one must pay attention to the place of fishing. He's not qualified to go fishing anywhere. Uncle, the tomb of the Demon Emperor has a huge connection, don't you plan to go? Lin Chen asked again. The matter involves the ancient emperor, and theoretically, even saintly figures would be envious. After listening to the explanation of the holy master of the Ji family, Lin Chen suddenly realized. Uncle certainly wants to go, but a few days ago, there was a change in the ancient holy land. Major forces such as the Jiang family, Yao Guang holy land, and Yao Qi holy land are all intervening. The implication is that the holy master of the Ji family needs to deal with the affairs of the ancient holy land, and there is no time to separate at this time. Ji Wen said that this great power has come forward and is already highly valued. Chenner, are you going to take a look? The holy master of the Ji family asked, seeing through Lin Chen's thoughts at a glance. Lin Chen didn't conceal it and nodded to admit. Although the demon emperor's tomb is a treasure trove, it is also full of danger. Uncle, don't worry, I have a sense of propriety and won't act recklessly. That's also thrilling. Oh, it's just time to go out and broaden your horizons. I'll send you to the tank first. Holy Lord Grandpa, I'm going too. Gzue suddenly spoke at this moment, her big eyes flashing with excitement. The Demon Emperor tomb is very interesting. As a peerless fairy in the future, how could she miss Jizue? Okay, young people nowadays are really newborn calves who are not afraid of tigers. The holy master of the Ji family sighed. Take Lin Chen and Jizue onto the golden chariot, and instruct Ji to quickly leave after hearing a few words, rushing to the ancient holy land. What kind of dress do you two have? As soon as she got on the tank, Ji Wen Dao scolded the two of them. Lin Chen and Ji Ziyue were all focused on the tomb of the demon emperor and forgot about this matter for a while. That's it, I can't even wash my name when I jump into the yellow river now. Surprisingly, my fairy's lifelong name has been ruined like this. That bastard Lin Chen, if there's a chance, we must torture him severely. Ji Ziyue secretly wrote a notebook in her heart. Fairy revenge, it's not too late for ten years. After Lin Chen finished changing his clothes and walked out, he immediately received countless admiring, jealous, and hateful looks from the male disciples of the Ji family. He is not as sensitive as Ji Ziyue, and his heart is incredibly calm. Seeing his reaction, Ji Wendao was somewhat surprised. I have won the daughter of my Ji family, but I am not proud or complacent. No wonder I can defeat that kid Haoyue. Grandpa Wen laughed and said, that day, Brother Hao Yue gave way to me, and Zi Yue and I were just friends. Is it really just a friend? Someone muttered to themselves. Everyone's expressions were very strange. How could Lin Chen, as a person of two generations, not see through? Ji Zi Yue, I have done my best, but people's hearts are not ancient. The nine-headed Qingjiao pulled the golden chariot, along with other Jijia ancient chariots, all at a fast speed. If it weren't for the help of the holy master of the Ji family, even if Lin Chen broke through the realm of the life spring and could control the divine rainbow to fly, he wouldn't be able to catch up. 
The Ji family is thousands of miles away from the Yen state where the demon emperor's tomb is located. However, in just a moment's time, the surrounding scene changed greatly, and a huge volcanic crater could already be seen ahead. Inside the volcano, there floats a magnificent ancient temple that is crystal clear and divine. That's the demon emperor's tomb. End of this chapter. Chapter 9 Fishing in the Void Rewards that can shake the eastern wilderness. You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 9 Fishing in the Void Rewards that can shake the eastern wilderness. Although the news did not flow out for long, Lin Chen and others were already latecomers. Outside the tomb of the demon emperor, various forces gathered. There are the leaders and elders of the six major caves of the Yen Kingdom, and the weakest have all reached the third realm of the Luanhai secret realm. The Divine Bridge. Other strengths are even more terrifying. For transcendent forces, including the Shaking Light Holy Land and the Yao Qi Holy Land, have all arrived in large numbers. And with a powerful and terrifying aura that is no less powerful than Ji Wen Dao. At this moment, the tomb of the demon emperor is truly a gathering place in all directions. Surprisingly, so many people have come, it's so lively. Is that the demon emperor's tomb? It looks so extraordinary, there must be a treasure hidden inside. Ji Ziyue looked around like a curious baby. Even as the fourth-ranked genius in the Ji family, such grand scenes are rarely seen. The great emperor's tomb is something that only exists in legends, but now it has been revealed in reality. But when Ji Ziyue looked at Lin Chen, she found that he was actually fishing again. That's right. Lin Chen sat at the bow of the boat, swinging his fishing rod out and fishing in the void. Ji Ziyue was dumbfounded. What operation is this? Lin Chen, you don't even have water. What are you fishing for? Fishing for loneliness. There's the demon emperor's tomb ahead, and you still have the heart to do such a boring thing. You're really impressed. Ji Ziyue wrinkled her playful little nose, feeling that Lin Chen was not witty. Lin Chen ignored her and went fishing for himself. Although there is no water, is the celestial fishing system such an inconvenient thing? Just now, Lin Chen asked the system and the answer he received was that he could fish even without water. It's simply too humanized. I don't know what can be caught from this demon emperor's tomb, I'm looking forward to it. Lin Chen immersed himself in his mind and forgot about the outside world. At this moment, Ji Wen Dao walked towards this side and saw Lin Chen fishing in the void. At first, I was puzzled, then suddenly realized. A look of enlightenment on my face. Ziyue, don't disturb me. Lin Chen, this kid, should be enlightened. Enlightenment. Ji Ziyue tilted her little head and didn't understand the relationship between Lin Chen's behavior and Wu Dao. Seeing her reaction, Ji Wen Dao was not surprised and patiently explained. What is the way? The way is hidden in all things, or in other words, everything in this world is the way. Meditation can help one understand the way, observing the Dharma can help one understand the way, walking in the mortal world can help one understand the way, and fishing in the void can naturally help one understand the way. Lin Chen is comprehending the laws and morals of this world in his own way, truly extraordinary. You should also learn more. After breaking through the quadrupole realm, it will not only be a matter of resources, but most importantly, enlightenment. Ji Wen Dao said earnestly. Ji Ziyue understood half of it. But I vaguely realized that Lin Chen's behavior of fishing in the void seemed very impressive. Did he use a straight hook to fish in the courtyard before, not just fishing, but actually gaining enlightenment? I don't think it's okay. Upon thinking about it, Lin Chen's image in Ji Ziyue's heart suddenly grew taller. He's just destined for the spring realm, why is he so powerful? No, Miss I will become a fairy in the future and cannot fall behind. Grandpa Wen Dao, help me find a fishing rod that needs a straight hook. Ji Wen said, what? Is this girl? 
misunderstood what he said just now. Let you understand, who made you learn from Lin Chen. Can everyone have the same way of enlightenment? This girl usually looks mischievous and mischievous, why is she a bit unintelligent when it comes to critical moments? Lin Chen did not pay attention to external affairs. Otherwise, the expression would definitely be very exciting. With the passage of time, there have been various changes in the outside world, and even some people have attempted to attack the tomb of the demon emperor. But none of this affected Lin Chen until the fishing rod was pulled and pulled. Here we go. Lin Chen suddenly opened his eyes, his spine like a dragon, and he stood up. Just as the straight hook pulled out a colorful bubble from the void that only Lin Chen could see. The system sound also sounds along with it. Fishing successful, location. Demon Emperor Yang Tomb. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the Void Immortal Gold. Void Immortal Gold. A sacred treasure material, born from the void, with a natural void Tao pattern. It is a rare immortal gold that can be forged into an immortal artifact. After reading the item introduction, Lin Chen's face lit up with joy. Undoubtedly, this is the first fishing reward, with no extraordinary quality. Void immortal gold, comparable to Dao Jie gold and dragon pattern black gold in the sky covering world, is an unparalleled immortal material that can forge immortal weapons. It's just that there are no immortals in the world, which makes it difficult for immortal tools to appear in the world. And when Lin Chen saw the size of this void immortal gold clearly in the system space, he was even more shocked. The dragon pattern black gold cauldron in the shaking light holy land is rumored to be forged from more than half of the square dragon pattern black gold, but my void immortal gold is actually more than one square, enough to make two extreme weapons. Even the great emperor of ancient times may not be able to find the immortal gold divine material that is enough to forge extreme weapons in his lifetime. The abundance of void immortal gold in this area can shake the entire eastern wilderness if released. There will be plenty of treasures to purchase. However, Lin Chen has no intention of selling it. Cultivators forge weapons and never mind having too many materials. The more immortal gold, the more power and patterns it can carry. The weapons refined naturally become stronger. These void immortal gold, prepared by Lin Chen, are all used to forge his own tools. If we can gather a variety of immortal gold in the future, we can forge an unparalleled weapon and achieve immortality in the world. But with my current strength, not to mention refining immortal gold, it's even difficult to cut. It is necessary to borrow the power of powerful individuals within the clan, or go to the unique land of Jin's fire domain. Lin Chen wants to refine the Void Immortal Sword, but he is currently unable to do so. But it doesn't mean that the Void Immortal Gold is useless now. Lin Chen took out the Void Immortal Gold from the system space and stored it in the Wheel Sea. A vast expanse of ethereal immortal gold floats like a continent on the Sea of Supreme Suffering. Being constantly washed away by the sea of suffering, contaminated with the scent of forest dust, reduces the difficulty of refining in the future. The innate Tao patterns on the ethereal immortal gold are of great benefit to Lin Chen. Lin Chen practiced the Void Sutra and walked the path of the void. To him, the ethereal immortal gold with many sides is simply a stone of enlightenment. Just a moment after being included in Luanhai, Lin Chen felt that his understanding of the Void Sutra had greatly improved. There is a continuous stream of new insights into imperial techniques such as the Great Void Technique and the Void Handprint. Especially Lin Chen is still in the initial stage of cultivation, and his understanding of the Dharma is only at the surface level. Make this improvement particularly noticeable. If you use the Void Hand Print again, its power can be at least doubled. Lin Chen secretly estimated and came to this conclusion. And he felt that even if he didn't refine the void immortal gold sacrifice into a weapon, only the immortal gold itself was also a deadly weapon. If such a large piece of immortal gold were used to smash people, its power would definitely be impressive. It wouldn't be intimidating to encounter holy soldiers. Undoubtedly, it is a rare treasure of immortal materials that even ancient emperors could not find. For me now, 
it has many wonderful uses. But just now the system prompted that it was the demon emperor's young tomb. If you fish in the demon emperor's Yin tomb, you should still have a big harvest. End of this chapter. Chapter 10. Fishing in the Yin tomb. Direct to the scriptures of the extreme path. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 10 Fishing in the Yin Tomb Direct to the scriptures of the extreme path. The tomb of the demon emperor sank and floated in the volcano, attracting the attention of all sides. However, no one knew that it was just the Yang tomb placed on the surface by the Qing emperor. The burial in the Yin Tomb of the demon emperor is the most important green emperor's spiritual essence and the treasure of the eastern wilderness. The Wild Pagoda Lin Chen is well aware of the terror of the ancient emperor, and naturally has no thoughts about the Yin tomb where the green emperor's spiritual essence is located. But I have a great interest in fishing in the Yin tomb of the demon emperor. I'm fishing at the grave while others jump around. I hope the Qin emperor won't suddenly come out and strangle me. Lin Chen joked in his heart. At this point, the five forces have begun to besiege the imperial tomb palace. The five great experts each sacrificed powerful weapons and unleashed the power of Sendai. The divine beast patterns appear on the imperial tomb palace, with a demonic aura soaring to the sky. Two forces collided fiercely in mid-air, causing the sky and earth to lose color, and the stars seemed to be about to fall. Although this place was deliberately left a loophole by the Qing Emperor, and the remaining demonic power has passed with the passage of time, leaving no trace of it. But with the joint efforts of the five great powers, it was still difficult to win it for a while. Not long after, the demon emperor's young tomb will be opened, and there will be a competition at that time. Find the Yin tomb before that and receive the reward for your first fishing. Lin Chen finished and stood up. Glancing sideways, he couldn't help but be stunned. I saw Ji Ziyue sitting next to him at some point, holding a fishing rod in her hand. He is learning to fish in the void with a certain attitude. Is this woman mentally unstable? This is Lin Chen's first idea. He's fishing because of the system, and Ji Ziyue's fishing is really lonely. This is not a mental illness. What is it? Just as Lin Chen felt puzzled, Ji Ziyue's pretty face showed a proud expression. Humph. How are you doing? Do you know my Mrs. Prowess? Lin Chen, don't think you're the only one who can understand the Tao. Miss, I have the gift of indulging in heaven, and I can easily grasp the Tao. Lin Chen was speechless for a moment. Although I didn't understand what she was saying, I was greatly shocked. Excuse me, please continue. After Lin Chen finished speaking, he turned around and left. He felt that staying by Ji Ziyue's side could potentially lead to infection and suffer from mental retardation. This is even more terrifying than the supreme treasure technique. Ha! Huh. Where are you going? Seeing Lin Chen about to leave, Ji Ziyue immediately stood up. Stroll around everywhere. Lin Chen replied with a very perfunctory attitude. But this actually aroused Ji Ziyue's curiosity. To be honest, sitting on the bow of the boat fishing for air, she's almost bored to death. I just watched Lin Chen sit still without any movement, so I didn't want to give up and hold on. Lin Chen rode away under the rainbow, and she quickly followed. What are you doing with me? Who's following you? I'm just strolling around, Mississippi. GZUS snorted lightly, her beautiful eyes slanted. Speaking so, but the body is very honest. No matter how Lin Chen twists and turns, he just follows closely behind. Lin Chen was too lazy to care about her, and was all focused on searching for the Yin tomb of the demon emperor. In my memory, the Yin tomb of the demon emperor should be located under a deep pool in a nearby mountain range, which is difficult to discover. But Lin Chen deliberately searched, and with his cultivation in the spring realm, he could have a powerful divine sense to explore. In less than fifteen minutes, the dark and secluded deep pool was discovered in the mountains not far from the Ji family's chariot. 
Just getting close, you can feel a chill that penetrates deep into the bone marrow. Lin Chen, what place is this? It's chilly, I don't like it. Ji Ziyue said. Even with her cultivation in the palace realm, she couldn't ignore the chill of the deep pool. If you don't like it, just leave on your own. Lin Chen said, unable to get used to it at all. A small stool was placed by him by the deep pool. Are you fishing again? What can you catch in this broken pool? In the eyes of real fishermen, every place with water is a fish's nest. Seeing Lin Chen's serious demeanor, Ji Ziyue didn't even know if he was pretending or what. This cold pond, let alone a fish, would probably freeze to death on the spot if a cultivator fell in. Lin Chen naturally didn't say anything. After sitting down, he left and threw out his fishing rod, falling into the cold pool. Although this place is the Yin tomb of the demon emperor, there is great terror. But as long as it is not contaminated with blood and triggers the imperial tomb killing machine, there will not be too much danger. I waited for more than ten minutes this time, but the fishing rod didn't respond. But Lin Chen was not impatient, instead enjoying this leisurely and relaxed state. After more than ten minutes, Ji Ziyue felt like grass was growing on her head. Lin Chen suddenly opened his eyes, lifted the fishing rod, and a colorful bubble floated out of the water. Fishing successful, located at the Yin tomb of the demon emperor. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the Primitive True Explanation Volume 1. Divine Attraction Chapter The item has been allocated to the system space and can be viewed by the host at any time. Original True Solution When hearing the system prompt, Lin Chen Hu's body shook. Compared to fishing for the immortal gold in the void, my mood shakes even more. View Item Information Original True Explanation Volume 1 Divine Introduction Chapter The Supreme Immortal Scripture Written by the Corpse Immortal Emperor The Divine Introduction Chapter is a chapter in the field of humanity, which can truly showcase the extraordinary power of Divine Introduction when combined with the Universal Spirit Map. This is the supreme scripture in the field of humanity, created by the first immortal emperor since the founding of heaven and earth. Tracing the source is incredibly terrifying. The only scripture that Lin Chen caught while fishing was the divine citation, lacking the All Souls map and not complete. However, even so, its level still far exceeds that of the supreme bone, which is difficult to compare with the scriptures of the great emperor. It is an unimaginable treasure in the world of covering the sky. I used the Supreme Bone script to cultivate the realm of moving blood, but after reaching the extreme realm, my path was lost. But with the Divine Guidance chapter of the Primitive True Explanation, it is enough to support my cultivation of the Ultimate Tao and the Supreme Realm. Extreme Tao Supreme, on the same level as the Ancient Emperor. If one can cultivate to that level, they can be called invincible in heaven and earth. However, that realm is too far away for Lin Chen today. What he needs to do now is to take each step at a time. Build an unparalleled foundation in the early stages of cultivation. After obtaining the original solution, Lin Chen did not rush to continue fishing, but began to observe. The pure white bone blocks and profound rune fonts are densely packed, explaining the origin of the Tao, covering a wide range of phenomena, and directly pointing to the essence of cultivation. Lin Chen had already broken through the extreme realm of moving blood, but now he has undergone a transformation and his realm has become more perfect. His strength has not significantly improved, but he is deepening his understanding of the realm and consolidating his foundation. Shinshi flows on the surface of her body, like light feathers fluttering, about to feather and soar. This kind of scene is too supernatural, it dazzles Ji Ziyue on the side. In her eyes, Lin Chen Gang had just been fishing. Suddenly, he began to meditate and practice. Immediately after, various astonishing anomalies appeared on the body. Lin Chen, isn't he really fishing for enlightenment? Ji Ziyue's mouth opened slightly, unable to understand this kind of thing. It's so thoughtless. At this moment, several divine rainbows shot from afar, including several elders from the misty sky. 
I thought I had discovered an ordinary treasure trove, but to my surprise, it turned out to be the tomb of the demon emperor. Nowadays, ancient aristocratic families and holy sites have arrived one after another, and we, the people of the cave, may not have gained anything this time. Look ahead, there is a colorful glow swirling around. Is there a treasure born? An elder pointed towards the direction where Lin Chen was located. Light and feathers fall, the rosy glow shines everywhere, and the heavens and earth seem to resonate with it. End of this chapter